Hey, how's it going? Well, sometimes I get a little bit, I get a feeling like I'm, I'm kind of isolated out here. <clears throat> I enjoy the people here. I mean, everyone's very friendly here. But sometimes the isolation gets to me a little bit. It's five to six hours away from any major city here where I'm at. We're, we are definitely isolated in this region. Um, gas is really expensive here. It's... <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Maybe when you compare it to Canada or some places in Europe, it's not that expensive, but it's like, you know, 389 here a gallon. And compared to the rest of the US, that's really expensive. But uh some of that is simply because this area is isolated. But it's also a gem. People are very involved in the arts here. Some of the most in this county than even the rest of the U.S. You know, why am I walking this way? There's, there's nothing in this direction, so. Here's the North Coast Co-op. So I enjoy living out here. The people are very cool here. You can talk to just about, not everyone, but just about everyone. And they don't look at you like, why is this person talking to me? What does this person want from me? You know? But sometimes the isolation gets, gets to me a little bit. I'm used to being able to drive a short distance and being in a big city, like when I lived in Tacoma. Short distance, either by driving or by bus or whatever. And I'd be in Seattle. When I was even in Shimokin, I could drive for about three hours or so and be to a big city, be somewhere like Philadelphia, or I could be in New York. But here it's a five or six drive, five or six hour drive to get to a Sacramento or, <clears throat> or San Francisco. So Now the advantage is that it's only that far to get to that type of major city, but still, Being how isolated the area is, it's understandable why people almost feel they have to be more friendly than normal. So, because it does have that element of a small town, you know? You do something bad, everybody knows about it. So, anyway, and that's all I've got to say. Banana.